Hi students, how are you all? Hope you all are well and good. So today we are going to start again our new chapter, chapter number 4, working with MS Paint. We will continue with this chapter. In my previous video, I have told you that I will take, I will tell you about the uh, tools that are given in the software with which you can draw. So looking into the tools, you, you can see here, this is the ribbon. This is the ribbon in which all the tools are present. Okay, from here you have to select the tools and you have to draw on the drawing area. Got it? This is the working window of MS Paint. Okay, this is the window of the MS Paint and here in the home tab you can see various tools are given in the ribbon. From here, first of all we will start with this pencil tool. See here what it is written here. Pencil. Draw a free form line with the selected line width. Of course, first of all you have to select this pencil tool and then you have to select the size of the pencil I mean size of the line suppose I am selecting this one and after selecting I am drawing a flower with the help of this line see suppose I am drawing a flower okay I am not at all a good painter please adjust with my painting <laughs> okay As I have completed drawing this flower, we have to fill this flower with colors. For filling up with colors, you have to select this fill with color option. Make a click on this fill with color option and select any of the colors. Suppose I am selecting red from here and then filling it into the petals. See? Okay? And I am selecting yellow color to fill the middle. Got it? Now this blank spaces, in this blank spaces also you can fill color of your own like this, this, okay, like this you can draw a flower, got it? And after drawing the flower, now you can add text over here by clicking here. This is the text option. By clicking here, your text will be activated and you have to make a box over here so that you can write and select the color of the text in black. Okay? Now I am typing over here. Suppose you, have, you can type your name. Your name over here. And after typing your name, you can select the style of the text from here suppose this one I am selecting and you can select the size of the text also from here I am selecting this this ok after done after it is done you cannot modify it or you cannot do anything with this got it now after the text tool here comes the eraser tool this is the eraser tool with the help of this eraser tool you can erase the drawing or you can erase any part of the drawing which you have thought that you don't want to be in the drawing area okay now i'm showing you how it can erase the drawing by clicking it it will change into an eraser you can see here this is the eraser you can increase the size of the eraser by control plus control plus plus button okay Control CTRL control plus the plus button after selecting it you can see here I am rubbing the drawing very easily okay you can rub the drawing very easily as well as you can rub this name also so this was the work of the eraser tool okay again I am bringing up the drawing drawing came again okay now this is the color picker tool color picker tool suppose you have drawn anything over here I am drawing a rectangle 
and you want this color this yellow color in this rectangular figure then what you will do you have to use this color picker tool as you click on this and you select this make a click on this yellow color see the yellow color is selected and as you fill this box with color this yellow color will come into this box okay now after that comes this zooming tool or the magnifier tool with the help of this magnifier tool you can magnify any part of the picture suppose i want to magnify this part of the picture see the box is coming you have to make a click and see this part is magnified again if you want to magnify then see this part is magnified okay now this was the function of the tools of the six tools that i have shown you over here got it now children talking about the brush tools see this is the brush tool and here various brush options are given first option is the brush tool see it it is like this the next one is the calligraphy brush one see it is like this the next is the calligraphy brush two see it is a bit bolder than the first one next is the spray tool airbrush see this is the airbrush tool next this one this one is the oil brush tool see by clicking it see this is the oil brush tool next this one is the crayon tool see it seems like crayon next one is the marker tool you can use it as a marker on any portion of the drawing this one is the natural pencil tool see with the help of this pencil tool you can draw in a pencil color and the last is the water color brush see it also shows the water color in the screen okay now this was the end of the brush tool now this was the end of the tools options that are given in the home tab in my next video i'll be showing you some other tools also uh, through which you can draw various objects various drawings on the drawing area okay uh, to this thank you